One of the features of GeoGebra is that it has the ability to create web pages by going to File and Export. And when you decide to create a dynamic worksheet as web page, you'll notice that it pops up a window and it wants a title and text above the construction and text below the construction. When it says construction, what it's talking about is the entire view that was available within the GeoGebra window. So if you have the algebra view visible, it will include the algebra view within the construction. This text that you see right here is what goes on above the construction. Consider this to be maybe directions on how to use the actual dynamic worksheet. And then down here could be questions on what you want students to investigate. And then once you have all of this done, when you click Upload, if you've signed up for a account with GeoGebra, it will automatically create a web page, upload it to a site that GeoGebra runs called GeoGebra Tube. And what this is, is a repository of all sorts of dynamic worksheets that teachers have created or other individuals. And when you click these buttons down here, they are basically there to allow you to create additional sections for the web page. When you do save and close, it's going to ask if you would like to provide some type of tag or metadata. Those tags are used to help organize these files so that other educators can locate your particular web page if it talks about the same topic. For right now, I'm not going to fill in any tags. I'm just going to click no thank you. And it will save that. And you can see that it's already uploaded this twice, once when I was practicing earlier, and then Again, when we uploaded it, it's going to timestamp it, show who the author is, and if we click on it, you can see what the URL is. And over here to the right-hand side, moving this over, you can see that there's the standard icon to share right here with others. And when you click on it, it's going to ask you what type of link you would like. I usually just use the shortened uh, GeoGebra tube link right here. And when you click on it, um, you can copy it to the clipboard just by using this icon. So that concludes our overall production of this algebra project and how we can turn it into a web page for others to view on our own websites.